Hey guys welcome. This is TechAid TV. In this video, I will show you how to connect Wi-Fi direct of this Epson L3150 printer. So we can print wirelessly through its Wi-Fi direct connection. So, without further ado, let's get started. First, press the power button. Then wait until the Wi-Fi flashing light stops. Then press the Wi-Fi button once to enable Wi-Fi direct connection. When the Wi-Fi direct lights are turned on, before pressing the network status button, place at least three sheets of A4 size paper in our paper tray. Then, hold down the network status button for at least seven seconds. until the printer starts printing its network status information. The network status information consists of three pages. So wait for it until printing finishes. Then get the information sheet and look for Wi-Fi direct information. Then keep the Wi-Fi direct SSID and password. Then, before connecting our mobile smartphone, let's first have an internet connection. And go to the Play Store. And download the Epson Iprint mobile application. So, to download, go to search bar. Then search for Epson Iprint. Then choose the first item from the list. Then press install. Then wait until it finishes downloading and installing the application. Then before we open the application, go to setting. To connect our smartphone to our Epson L3150 printer, then select printer SSID, then type the password, and connect. This Wi-Fi network has no internet. Connect anyway? Then choose connect. Then open the Epson iPrint application. Then press agree. Then press OK. Then we can now skip this application tour. And tap here to select a printer. Then the system will prompt. You need to share your smartphone location information to connect the product. Just select next. Then select allow only while using this app. Then a Repson L3150 is shown here. Just tap the select. Then now we have successfully connected to our Epson L3150 printer. So now we can print photos, documents, or even scan wirelessly via Wi-Fi direct connection. Then now let's try to print photos. Tap Photos. Then select Allow Epson iPrint to access a photo. Then now we can choose a photo to print. Then press Select to choose a photo to print. Then select Next. Then you can go to Setting. To add a number of copies, change the paper size, a media type, or even the print quality. Then select Done. Then select Print. Then now we have successfully print the document via Wi-Fi direct connection. And that's how simple it is to connect via a direct Wi-Fi connection and enable mobile printing of this Epson L3150 printer. And I hope you've learned how to connect Wi-Fi direct of your Epson L3150 printer in this video. And if you are new on our YouTube channel, please subscribe for more tutorial videos. Thank you for watching.